broken. Um, going, my hair is kind of dry. Oh yeah, going to shadow for neurosurgery, but I need to fix my hair when I get that. Okay. Then you can choose the time here. Yeah. And why? Oh. So it started, mine has done that, and I've done that like for the past two weeks, and then. If you turn here one time to the right, mm -hmm. it goes for this mode, or this one, or this mode. Oh. So those are what? It's the Hoven. Like if different. You, if you only do it, if you do it all for the left, uh -huh. it goes for the microwave. One for the right, it's okay. the Hoven, and then you can choose. You can see temperature here. Temperature, okay. More time. Okay. Oh. Uh, then this special modes, not really. Do you touch those at all? Mm. What is that? <laughs> I don't know. For, you don't, yeah, you well, don't. For the um, oven. So that's the oven? That's the oven. Oh. So maybe try to, when you turn on, put this to the right. Okay. Plastic spanner, lower, okay. roll touch to. Hey guys, so I realized I forgot to do yesterday's review, but I was in neurosurgery and we watched two small surgeries. Um, one was actually done completely by residents, I'm pretty sure. No, not completely by residents, but most of it was done by residents. Um, one was a ventriculostomy and the other one was a shunt. Both were to remove extra cerebral spinal fluid that built up in the patient. And yeah, um, the first one, um, they made a burr hole to let it escape, but the second patient didn't work, so they had to create a long tube from the head to um, the abdomen, which was just along the spine, like the side, to let it. And they were all very friendly. Um, they stopped and explained stuff in English, so that was nice and different compared to other departments. Um, but yeah. <music>
Thank you.